The Dow comes crashing down 117 points. This is Dez here at Rock Trade, and it is Tuesday, September 23rd, 2014, and the market sell off violently. SP down 0.6%, Dow down 0.7%, NASDAQ down 0.42%. Russell's off by almost a nearly a full percent. Banks off by more than one percent. Definitely saying the markets are in fact bearish. VIX confirming it by spiking higher by nine percent. Now I'm not going to throw a fifteen on the on the VIX. Gold in positive territory up zero point six four percent. With silver still lagging. Been talking about this rising wedge on the S&P 500 daily chart. And on Friday, it said big time warning. Look for big red chunky candlesticks to follow. Yesterday, we got that one. Boom. Breaking down through an area of support today. Follow through. Boom. To the downside. Now, we have here on the MACD. We have the MACD line now sub zero down below the zero line and very bearish on a very steep trajectory downward here be interesting to see what happens on the weekly chart blow this up we've been talking about the green line the red line we should stay between it today we close at the day's low and this is a weekly chart we are now on the wrong side of this red line last two times we did this though we rallied back it'd be interesting to see if we'll do that on the monthly chart, it's just up, 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 up. We're just hanging out up here, but with a red candlestick at this moment. A lot of you guys trade technicals. Take a look at this. We popped up, and then we dropped. This was a big, big problem here. So we had this triangle here. It came down, down, broke it yesterday. And now we have what's called a drag, or a, I'm sorry, a grave stone doji. Reversal pattern at a support level. Be interesting to see if we get a bounce going into tomorrow on tech stocks. And gold, we said we had a bounce. Take a look at that. It's a bounce, but people sold into it. Red candlestick on gold. Um, Apple was up 1.6%. Nice rally above the 20 day moving average. Heading higher, it's looking fairly bullish here. Um, Baba was off by 3%. It continues to dive here. I'm going to go to a 60 minute chart. And on a 60 minute chart, you can see the last few sessions were just drifting lower. But this is starting to roll over. Huge bullish diversion right here. And um, I think that Baba could be finding a base, a low. So be watching for a breakout over $88. So mark that down, $88. It could be an opportunity for a buy. And what else do we have here? Facebook was up almost 2% today. Uh, really nice little pop. And I'm holding Facebook, by the way, as a disclaimer. Um, GoPro I'm holding also. It was up almost 7% today. Nice bull flag, boom, to the upside. Let's see what volume is doing. Volume, nice step higher on volume. So my GoPro is making me some fat cash. And, um, Netflix was up not by much. That's not, um, I have Taser, and that's down 1% today. Um, thought that with this Dragonfly Doji, we should have got a bounce. We're not getting it yet. We do have an inverted hammer. So the two, two, um, 200 day moving average here could be a support area. So I'm still giving it some hope. I own Twitter and it was up 0.44%, uh, staying above the 20 day moving average. So um, be interesting to see what tomorrow brings us. Take care, safe trading. Mm -hmm.